two, one. Okay. Hey, look, so this is my classroom setup. It's what I call the social antisocial classroom. I've got my buddy Rivera filming this for me. Rivera, do me a solid. Just show the classroom. One thing you're gonna notice is how the tables and the chairs, they all face outwards. And at first it looks antisocial because students face outwards, but when it's work time, it's work like this. And then, yeah, I can just go right around. Dale, you probably wanna hide your face just for the witness protection program. Um, but like, so all the chairs face out. But when it's time to be social, all we do is we say circle up and we bring the chairs right on in and we get into a circle. Advantage of a circle is, I know they talk about it for restorative justice, but it's actually um, really helps out as far as like class discussions. I have, I'm still working on finding success with it, with restorative justice, but for the class circles, it's real obvious that someone has their cell phone out um, and we can have like a talking piece going around. Like right here, I've got what I call Bad Bunny. And we'll just toss him around and whoever's got the talking piece, like you call out, it'd be like, uh, Jaden, and toss it to Jaden, you know? Um, stuff like that. So, um, hey, one thing I do with a lot of my juniors and seniors, and I took this from like COVID, is I create notes online and like a lecture note. But the advantage is if somebody's absent or whatnot, or it frees me up as a teacher to really help out other students. So it's rather useful. The way we do it is this. Um, type out your notes that you want covered. And then there's this one extension you can get right here. I think it's Screencastify, all right? And with Crec, you can record, it's unlimited, and then you just put it up to your YouTube channel. But you just hit record, you record it, you'll see like your face come up, and uh, you just upload it to your Crec YouTube channel, all right? Mm -hmm. um, advantages too with this, that students can go at it student-paced, and uh, it's easy to get people caught up. Um, Back to the circle though for a second. Um, the reason why circles are really good versus traditional lecture is because traditional lecture, it's very just like Charlie Brown's teacher up there. Wah, 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 wah. We actually had two environmental lobbyists come in recently and they were, um, instead of doing like one, we had them for the whole day. So instead of doing like one period where it was like a lecture to like the whole auditorium, they were just in our classroom and we did a circle because it's better than the whole auditorium and even better than like lecturing in a class where everybody's in rows just because it's more of like everyone's got a seat at the table sort of mentality. Mm -hmm. um, another thing we like to do and I stole this from AAE is AAE's got these tables that are super nice because the tabletop is a whiteboard. All right. We don't have those here at my school, so we're doing low budget version of this. So you can get these at uh, Home Depot or Lowe's vinyl board. They're like under 20 bucks and they're four feet by eight feet and you just cut them to shape. So uh, I store them right over here and I can put these right on top of tables and they're basically like a glorified whiteboard. The one thing you're gonna need it's rags so you know old clothing just rag it up and uh you can put down whatever you want here whatever your talking pieces are mm -hmm. um white boards um plus circle um discussion yeah, that's generally how I do my class and I've found a lot of success with it. Um, other students, uh, D, do you mind uh, the circles at all? You like them? Yes, compared to like regular lecture? Yes. Gotcha. Rivera, how about you, buddy? I like it, I yeah. think it's nice. Yeah, it's a lot better, it's more homey feeling. It's more of a personal conversation with the class. Yeah, that's what I like. All right guys, do awesome.